Hey, Ahmed. Hey, Chantel. Um, Ahmed, let me start with you. Where is STC in its digital transformation journey? What are you trying to do at, and how far have you gotten with the transformation today? We start with our uh, digital transformation since more than one year. We have started with moving towards the convergibility. Uh, after that, we start working with Oracle to, to have to to uh, modernize all uh, our current CRM stack. So today we have finalized the infrastructure part and we are moving towards phase one, which is a full upgrading for the stack. And phase two will go for more automation and the, the launch product from Oracle, which will add a lot of value for STC. I mean, can you just elaborate a little bit, Ahmed, on what the business outcomes uh, that you're hoping to deliver as part of the transformation uh, and how Oracle's helping you with that. You can imagine that we are running today the our stack that was not upgraded for the very long time. And you can imagine the level of customization that we are running today with our current stack. So we are working with, with Oracle today to do a full modernization uh, that uh, and adding all these automation advanced tools that it will enable us to enhance the time to market, enhance the quality of our delivery. It also, it will uh, it will enhance the customer experience by the end of the day for uh, STC Bahrain customer. Chantel uh, from Oracle, let me come to you. How do you see and how does Oracle see the broader trend on telco digital transformation evolving in the industry? Uh, and in particular, you have this digital business experience program. Where does that fit into the whole picture? We're seeing service providers really want to modernize their stack, really want to improve uh, you know, operations by increasing automation. They're investing to improve the customer experience. And of course, AI is a really big you know, change driver for a lot of service providers. Um, and so with Oracle Digital Business Experience, we have built this AI-powered customer experience management platform. It is a complete BSS stack and so much more. Um, and it really infuses artificial intelligence to help service providers deliver more, you know, hyper-personalized, unique experiences to all of their customers while simultaneously improving business efficiencies, driving better business outcomes um, as well. Ahmed, AI is, is an interesting technology, right? Uh, because for service providers, uh, there's a sort of fork in the road here. A service provider can on the one hand, provide the infrastructure, the network capabilities to support other people's AI traffic, or they can become part of the AI, uh, a peer of the AI creative community by developing their own AI-enabled applications and services and using it to generate new revenues. Where are you with that? Yeah, you know, the AI now, it is a hype. Everyone is talking about AI. Our customer, they need all the communication to be based on AI. Um, our operation, all the decision uh, uh, coming from the operation side, it is based on AI. So it is in our top discussion today with uh, Oracle to bring all the AI capability towards our delivery and we can to have more efficient from uh, for the delivery point of view. And also using all these, you know, uh, a composable uh, IT stack with the, all these microservices. But as I said today, we have an STC Bahrain. We are working on, on very uh, uh, identified track related to the uh, AI with Oracle and all the partners. And the main objective is to enhance the efficiency of our operation and also to leverage or in case enhance the, the customer experience as well. But we are playing, as you said, all both the, the the infrastructure with all the intelligence that required from all the partners in order to achieve these goals. Let's talk about the second part of the equation, which really is where customer experience sits. I mean, AI is obviously having a big exp uh, big effect on this. What do you think's coming down the pike? What's next for customer experience in our industry? Sure. So at Oracle, we say the future of customer experience is autonomous. And what we mean by that is we believe that the communications industry should really be driving toward autonomous customer experiences and, you know, using technologies like generative AI and AI agents. And let's not forget all of this valuable data that service providers have, you know, at their fingertips that we can start to number one, 
personalized or hyper-personalized customer experiences at telco scale, right? Which is quite significant. We can also improve business efficiency. We can make the employees, so the, the humans within the service provider, much more efficient, much more effective, reducing the effort required to deliver those personalized customer experiences and overall drive better business outcomes. It's about making humans much more effective and reducing the effort on part of both the customer as well as employees to, to drive better uh, customer experiences as well. What do you see coming in the future for STC? What do you hope uh, to see from your network and, and, and the services that are operating on it in the future? And, and how is Oracle going to be part of that? I'm, I'm hoping to see by next year after we finalize or finish our transformation, I would like to have more efficient uh, delivery. We are bringing the latest technology to, to the business units and also to add more value towards the B2B from all the experience and the, uh, the experience that we have from, from Oracle. Thank you. Thank you both very much for, for talking to me today. Uh, this is really interesting. And thank you for de-hyping what's going on with AI. I thought this was very pragmatic.